Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video it will be another tutorial video. Uh, in today's video I'll be showing you how to look after your horse and what you exactly need to do to get it to level up. Basically it's just telling you a bit more about the horse Howdy, itself. Sir. So, for the uh, purpose of this video I will be going to buy a new horse uh, to just show you you know top to bottom so the first thing you want to do is if you want a new horse you'll need to go to the stable let's head to the stable now obviously guys you probably already know this bit but you know it's just starting from top to bottom uh, okay let's go so I'm in Saint Denis here as usual because I quite like Saint Denis it's a uh, nice little uh, nice little place not round here, I just feel like I'm going to get stabbed by someone or something, I don't know, it's very... Right, okay, once we're here, uh, we can go inside. There we go. Okay, so, first things first, it'll bring you to this menu here. You want to click on horses, you want to click on manage horses. And you want to buy a slot. So, just... Uh, Obviously, I've bought all these slots, but like the ones that are like locked, if they're all locked for you, you'll need to buy it. It'll obviously cost you $750 for that to purchase. But because I had a few horses and I got rid of them, I have some empty slots here. So, we're going to click on the slot and we're going to buy a horse. Now, there's a few different horses here that we can choose from. Uh, we've obviously got riding, drift, race, war, work, that, and that. Uh, one I like quite a lot is, so this is currently the horse I, I would personally buy, but I'm going to go on to this one, and this is the fastest horse you can buy. So as you can see here, you can see that with the white horse, if we buy the white, white male or female, it doesn't really, doesn't really matter, the stamina stays the same, the black has a little bit of a boost there and is 42 gold. Some horses will be unlocked out through the game, which I'll show you in a second. Some horses you'll already have, and some levels can be unlocked with your rank. So, let's say we want to buy... I want to say the white. Uh, I know that my friend has a white one, and it's pretty uh, powerful. I already have this, this one here, uh, which I'll show you in a second. But we'll buy this horse here for $850, and we're going to name it... Uh, let's say we're going to name it Fred, no, Jeff, okay, we're just going to name it Jeff, you can obviously name it whatever you want for this purpose of this video, I'll name it Jeff, so, once you've got Jeff, uh, we'll go, where is Jeff, there's Jeff, so, I think I've named Junior, no, Junior's a different horse, which one's, uh, can't remember which one I've got now. Anyway, so we're going to go to Jeff. I'm going to click on Jeff. And you're going to want to buy a saddle. So, if you already have a horse and you just want to use a saddle, you can. But for the, obviously the purpose of this video, I'm going to add a saddle. And obviously we're going to choose a saddle that we like. Now the saddle has an impact on how fast your horse can go. So... I think it's this saddle here and we're going to want to click improved and that will cost 11 gold obviously you can choose the color of your uh, of your saddle you want I'm probably going to go for this it's an eye it kind of goes with the white of the horse so I'm going to buy that for 11 gold after you've done that you can kind of add stuff to your horse like saddle bags so we can see here that I can change the colour of a bag or I can go to upgraded saddle bags and you've kind of got that there or um, you can go for bags like this which I don't know why I bought that but I'm going to probably buy this because I quite like kind of goes with the the leather of the uh, the saddle after we've done that we can go down uh, and these these have a big impact so this is this here is the best one you can get uh, it has here the speed and the yellow bar here uh, shows you how much it's going to improve your horse's speed 
So that's the best one to get. So obviously we're going to buy that. Or if you were like me, you could just go for one you like. But, you know. Right, so now, you know, you can... This has no really purpose. Uh, it has more like a design quality type thing. So I quite like the eagle. But we're going to go for something different. Uh, was that was that a compass? Which one was it? Uh, that one, that one. Oh, that's quite nice. I'm gonna go for that one. So that is not the one I bought, but okay. Right. Oh. Right. Yeah. Uh, then you can go on the blankets. The blankets underneath the horse, which you can't really see. Uh, so it's it's kind of a bit pointless, really. Uh. Anyway, so that's glitched out. Bedroll is your bed on the back. Again, it has no purpose. It's kind of just uh, just there for show. So I quite like these ones here. And we're just going to go for... Um, let's go for brown. Just to kind of get, get there. Lanterns. The lanterns will be unlocked once you get to a certain level. I can't really remember the level of the... of Well, of it. Uh, some 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 stuff on the horse is like not just your rank but it's like your rank for I don't know if like trader or you know the inner ranks but I quite like the lantern because it lights up the path so we're gonna buy a lantern masks I'm not entirely sure about masks yet I'm still trying to learn that myself if you want to see another video on that just let me know in the comments down below so we've got our horse uh, we need to go back here back oh no we can also have appearances too so this is not the horse I was just on, and I've gone back. Okay, let's just cut that. <laughs> um, this is a horse I recently bought the other day, uh, which I'm currently still upgrading a bit. So, we'll go back in here, and we'll click on the horse we need. So, horses. No, we don't want to buy another horse. Manage. So, if you want to go back into your horse, you just click on manage horse. Uh, Jeff. So you can change the appearance of your horse, so like uh, its hair, uh, which I quite like the black hair, uh, which looks quite nice. Uh, you'll see on all my horses I have kind of that long long hair, uh, probably same with the tail as well, probably be a long tail, because I quite like that. That sounds wrong, don't take that the wrong way. Services, so horse insurance and... It should, yeah, and the care package too, so it kind of just gives that, that, that boost of your horse, which won't stay there forever. Anyway, so, now, as you can see in the right bottom right-hand corner, you can see Make Active. So if you want to ride your horse there, you, you click that button, uh, and if you want to get rid of it, you click Discard. And it's for the same for every horse as well. Hope, that's it. Hope's my... Uh, the black version of the horse I've got. Anyway, so you can click horse possessions as well, where you can get the food for the horses, uh, which actually does come in use, and I'll show you why. Uh, but yeah, let's let's come out with that, and now we should be able to come out on our horses. So as you can see, there bonding level is level one. To make that bonding higher, uh, I'll quickly show you this. So if we go into uh, player, and we go into we can see. Jeff there, and we click him, we can see that he's perfectly healthy, stamina is there, the mood, you know he's calm, uh, and yeah, so it'll say bonding level 1, and in the, in the bottom left hand side you'll have your progress, so 4 out of 35, uh, that'll go up, uh, the 35 will also go up, it'll go up to 75 and all that. So, to get your bonding up, you can brush your horse. So you can buy a brush in the in the stables. Uh, you don't; it doesn't just come with one. You can pat your horse. So as you can see, where my horse's ass is. No, yeah, there you go. See that that plus there. So that would have gone up. Uh, so if we go into progress, no, we don't need to go into progress. Sorry, I'm used to going into progress. Uh, player, Jeff, level 1, there we go, 15 out of 35. So we can see that's gone up quite a bit. 
Uh, if what I tend to do is you can lead your horse as well, and this will get its bonding up. So I'll usually go to Valentine and do a few laps of Valentine, and that'll get me up to level two. So if you just continue walking, it won't go up all the time. It'll kind of just go up, uh, you know, when it when it feels like it. So if we just kind of just wait there, and it'll go up. Your horse can also get underweight. There we go. See, your horse can also get underweight as well, so it's good to feed your horse. There we go, and that will also get your bonding level up straight away as well. When you get your bonding levels up, the speed of your horse will go up, and that, you, not your speed, the stamina of your horse will go up. Uh, out, out through. You can also do tricks as well. So if I get on my other horse here. Uh, it's I've got a level four bonding with this. Damn it! I did not damage a horse. Uh, you'll see that. Hello. Hello, sir. You fool! Just gonna beat up a random guy and move his body. That's what I like about about this. Like, uh, yeah. So we're gonna go and ditch this body over here, just out of sight from anyone else, so they don't start investigating. And we're gonna go in here. So. I'm gonna get. We're not gonna do this whole video on just uh, bonding with a horse, but I'll kind of show you what you can uh, what you can do. Uh, so if we get on my horse here, this this it was my first horse. Uh, the obviously I've got it up to uh, its uh, bonding is level four. It does only go up to level four as well. So when the levels go up, you'll start to earn tricks. And stuff like that as well. Uh, so as you can see, there the speed's gone up. That's all gone up. Bonding's level four. Health, uh, stamina. Yeah, he's clean, and it tells you a bit more about that. Anyway, so you start to earn tricks with your horse as well. So you can click buttons, and you can kind of. Why is it not doing it? There we go. You can do that. I think that's when you get to level two. Uh, you can also kind of drift your horse as well. So if we kind of want to take a sharp turn, you can do that. Uh, I think that's they're the only two tricks you can get, uh, if, as I know of. But yeah. So yeah. So that's pretty much all you need to know about the horses. The horses are not like GTA cars. Uh, like, you can bond with them and they're, they're a big part of the game really. Uh, just a kind of, like, man's best friend kind of thing is a horse. Um, but yeah, so I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see any more tutorial videos on Red Dead or any other game, just leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching, it's a bye from me. Bye-bye.